think they'll be successful. Um, not in the UK unless they throw a huge amount of marketing money at it and and are very aggressive through distribution or go direct. All right. Uh, look, I think unfortunately I have another call in in in, in only three minutes, so so I need to drop. I think this was was very helpful. And I mean, if I if I read you correctly, that you know the John guests specifically seem to be you know, there seems to be to to be nothing you know too major that that can kind of disrupt uh, this market. John Guest has a very nice position. Obviously, there is there is competition, but that's that's kind of natural and something you really need to understand. Yeah before you know investing in this space but uh, yeah i think you know it's a good bit it's it's the best product on the market it's uh it's uh, it's got a great brand reputation um and the market is naturally growing towards it as mm. as you know younger plumbers will have far higher adoption of the system um so plastic push for over time will grow and John Guest is in a good position through the right, distribu- you know, through the growing distribution channels in order to do that. So yeah. it, it, it's in it's in a good place. That's a fair summary. Do you, do you think, by the way, I mean, I, 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 we, we mentioned this a little bit earlier. Do you think there will be you know, a material slowdown uh, in terms of plastics and push fit penetration, or? You know, given that, as, as as you said, you know, a lot of these traditional plumbers are, are you know, either retiring, etc. So you will end up with a kind of maturity profile that is close, you know, getting close to maturity. And uh, or, or do you think there is really still more to go, so to speak, for for plastic? There's certainly you could certainly see there's there's you know there's good five years. Uh, you know, I think there's five years. I think ten is for you know the, the maturity of the market is certainly between five and ten years. Um, if it's nearer, but probably nearer sort of five, then you know you can never put a precise curve on it. I think it, it you know, it, plumbing plastic push fit will grow more than other um, fitting solutions um, over the next five to ten years when that market equilibrium is is brought more difficult to tell. Um, um, but yeah, it, 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 you know, it's, it, the, the the bigger issue um, is is the you know the only risk to volume to manufacturing volumes will be a, around the whole macroeconomic slowdown in in the UK and um, you know what your view on the housing market is and what your view on. Um, the general strength of the economy post Brexit, and I think that would be the biggest, the biggest risk factor is the general, the general macro macroeconomic um, uncertainty in the UK, with a business that is so hellishly dependent on uh, on the UK. Yeah, that uh, that's very fair. Uh, we looked actually at at that distribu- distribution business. Uh, a couple of months ago, uh, it's called Hughes Gray. You probably know about it. Oh, Hughes Gray, yeah. Yes, yeah. Hughes Gray. Uh, we Welsh. Qu- quite Welsh. Welsh uh, yeah, a Welsh bias business, yeah. In, in, indeed. Uh, very builder's merchant. Uh, we got quite comfortable actually around around the UK macro environment. I mean, especially around the kind of RMI and, and the more transaction, your high transaction volume kind of products, uh, which would fit you know quite nicely with, with the John Guest profile. As you said, it's not you know a lot of new build necessarily, but more towards the towards the main. Yes, business. I mean fundamentally, uh, the, the UK is is made up of 23 million households. Uh, Most of which are quite old and falling apart. So, so the, you know, the, you know, we have a very old housing stock. Um, so the RMI market is is pretty resilient and robust because it is repairs and maintenance. Um, it's the improvement part that suffers in in the recession, uh, and we uh, certainly saw that in 2007. Uh, is that discretionary spend just imploded, but repairs uh, and maintenance, you know, stayed. Yeah. What hit was certainly more robust. Yeah. That's fair. That's 
All right, I'm, I unfortunately have to drop. Uh, this was very Great. helpful. Uh, so thank you very much for taking the time. Uh, I'm sure you know we have your contact details through through GLG. So maybe if we have any follow ups as we progress with our work, we can yeah. you know, follow up. Happy, with happy to speak again. Excellent. Okay. Thank you very much and have a good so, weekend. Sorry. Thank you. Cheers. Thanks. Bye. Cheers.